Mike. This is Storm Valley. Things are gonna get bad. We're gonna be tested. Just know you are good. Tonight, tonight. Boys, if you're seeing this, I'm probably dead. Whoever gave the order to kill me is in the department. There's no way They're he's dead, team. No way he's dead, team. You should be careful. Your people. What? You dead? We're being framed. It's just us. No backup. We got two suspects. Lowry and Burnett. The damn fan on fire. Everybody <laughs> relax. The fire's on the outside. The house on the inside. Y'all are some terrible fucking fugitives. Put a bounty on them. They'll have it coming from cops. Cartel. And every gang in the city. The bounty is dead or alive. I take the three in the front. You take the six in the back. Oh no, the fuck you not. <laughs> oh, you hit? No, black jelly bean. Nobody likes that shit. These dirty pots attacked our families. We not losing today. Ooh. I need mean, nasty money. Oh. oh, shitty, shitty, bang, bang, motherfucker. <laughs> Be gone, Gator. I rebuke you. See, Mike? That's how you command the universe. <laughs> that motherfucker racist, Mike. Go. That motherfucker racist. Rated R. Bad Boys is forever going to be that franchise, which I will always love. I love Bad Boys 1 which came out in 1995. I love Bad Boys 2 which came out in 2003. I enjoyed Bad Boys for Life which came out 2020 and I think I'll probably enjoy this which is coming out in less than a month. You can argue with me on this but I would say that Michael Bay is designed to be making movies of that caliber and he suited the first two uh, first two movies. With Adil and Bilal they did the best for part three and part three it wasn't it was a enjoyable film scale wise it looks like it's there but this is supposed to be a switch your brain off action film that's what it will always be joe pantaleano one thing i loved about him is the charisma he brought to his role and he was that typical cliche angry captain and he worked their trope really well but i can't wait for this corruption cops r-rated summer blockbuster let's go for it the only issue i have with this movie is the title they should have called this bad boys for life it would have made a lot more sense as opposed to bad boys ride or die but it is what it is it's coming out june 7th what do you think of the official and final trailer let me know in the comments <laughs>